I'm going to show you how easy the buckle and buddy system is to install. Each buckle and buddy is going to come with a clip attached to two straps, one silicone ring attached to a strap, and a bobbin which all of the straps will connect to. The first thing you need to do is unhook the shoulder straps from the metal clip on the back of the five point harness system. On the new seats, there might be a guard that you need to release the tension on the front of the seat so that you can pull the straps out to have access to the metal clip so you can unhook the shoulder straps from the clip. Once you have the straps brought up to the front of the seat, grab the buckle and buddy. There's a loop of material next to the clip on each side and slide the shoulder strap up through that loop of material so you can re-secure it to the metal clip on the back of the seat. Now do that with each side and you're going to want to leave the clip of the buckle and buddy attached which will help you get the right tension when you're installing it the first time. So you also want to make sure that the five point harness system chest clip is brought through the loops of material also. You need the buckle and buddy sitting below the chest clip on the five point harness system. And then grab the straps of the buckle and buddy so you can bring them to the back. Now you can either bring them all the way around the car seat or you can bring them through the hole designed for the seat belt and out through the bottom slot for the shoulder straps of the five point harness system. Once you do that, make sure that you have good tension on the straps and slide the bobbin through a hole of the button elastic which will give you the proper tension. If it's too tight, the straps will get pulled to the side quickly and if it's too loose, the shoulder straps will fall behind your child still. So unclip the buckle and buddy and make sure that they come to the side for you. Now grab the silicone ring with the strap and bring the seat buckle of the five point harness system up and through that ring so that the ring is around the material and then pull to the front and around to the back and make sure again you have good tension on it so that the seat belt won't fall underneath your child and you don't have to dig for it but you also don't want it as tight as possible or you won't be able to bring it back so you can buckle it. So all of the straps are secured to the same bobbin and the buckle won't be able to fall behind your child. So now buckle everything up as you normally would. And now, when you unbuckle everything, the shoulder straps automatically come to the side and the buckle automatically comes forward. I hope you enjoy your buckle and buddy.